Welcome to the Floral POS. In this video, we're going to show you how to set up the Flower Shop Network. This is the update to one of our old videos. Um, Flower Shop Network has changed their interface, and we want to go ahead and update this um, video so you guys can see uh, how to set it up. Uh, basically, kind of a side note is you make you have to make sure that you call Flower Shop Network uh, to make them aware that you are using the Floral POS as your point of sale program. Uh, they have to actually turn a switch on so that you can send receive through our program. So if you call them, so this is what we're going to do next. We're going to click on control panel, system configuration, and then wire config. Once inside wire config, you're going to click on flower shop network, and then just follow along. You're going to select your shop. You're going to check mark active you're going to put in your shop ID. Uh, generally this is your phone number that they give you. You're going to put in your password that you use to log into your FSN F2F site. And then there's a new area here called token. Um, what you're going to do is you could click on get token if you wanted to. Uh, it's basically here if you had previously saved the shop ID and password. But all you really have to do is just click on the save button it'll automatically generate that new token for you. It's kind of a bunch of garbled numbers. Now what the, is the token? Well, uh, it's kind of the new way that Flower Shop Network um, communicates between the point of sale and their network. Instead of using your shop ID and password, it now uses this nice token. Uh, makes it more secure that way. On the left hand side, you're going to also notice there's a bunch of alerts in here. Um, basically use the alerts that you want to use. Uh, generally we like the system tray in the message center that will automatically uh, put your your alerts down here in the message center and also bring it in the system tray. You can have it send you a, an email alert and also a text message and lastly this enable logging is more just for technical purposes if we had an issue with any of your orders we could do logging and keep track of what's going on. So I'm just going to check mark system tray message center make sure I click on save and the last thing you're going to do and this is uh, kind of a important thing is you want to install the service if you do all this hard work here and get it working if you don't install this service um, you're never going to be able to uh, retrieve any orders so let's go ahead and hit install and you're going to see that it's running which is pretty awesome it's going to check every um, three minutes for a new order now keep in mind that this is generally only installed the service here is only installed on the server. So if you look at station two, three, four, however many stations you have, and you open it up and you look inside and you're like, oh, it's not running, that's because you're not on the server. Um, the server is the only area it needs to be running because it'll check and automatically grab all your messages and your orders and make sure that all your stations get informed that there is new orders and all that good stuff. Once you're done, just go ahead and X out and you're all set. And that's basically how to set up the, the new Flower Shop Network interface inside the Floral POS.